Hey guys, this is Kay Prize here. I am super excited. I'm actually uh, driving to a, a yard sale right now. Uh, on the yard sale, I didn't say it has any kind of video game or anything like that, but I talked to the lady. Uh, <clears throat> the lady said that, yeah, there's no video game here, but the lady that she's sitting might have some, and she has a list of stuff. So I asked her to send over some pictures, and what she did. And I'm gonna show you guys what's, the, what's, uh, what's in those pictures. Some of the rarest game you'll ever find in the wild. Uh, you know, we, we, we got uh, Earthbound, we got Dragon Warrior 1, 2, 3, and 4, and, and I believe Dragon Warrior 2 is complete. So, uh, and then uh, Luffy, uh, Lufia, um, some Zelda complete in box, uh, some other miscellaneous game, but they're all really, really good game. I total the, the, the value up, it's probably going probably gonna to be around 1500 worth of retail if I were to, you know, go out and buy all these games. Uh, so yeah, I uh, she asked me for an offer. I said 200. So the uh, the lady says that uh, she'll talk to the old uh, the lady that owns it and see if she's willing to let go for that price, or or uh, she'll give me a call back and maybe uh, we work the work something out. So I just decide just I'll go ahead and just head up there and just you know check it out and maybe do something there because I can't wait. I'm sitting here and waiting for the call back and it's, and it's killing me. So I'm just like I'm just gonna go. Hey guys, so um, she just texted me back, so I offered 200. So uh, she asked the lady. The lady uh, came back with 250. So yeah, hell yeah! Oh, I'm so freaking excited right now. Oh man! So I'm gonna show you guys what I got for 250. So um, yeah, so wait till the end. Don't go anywhere. All right. Okay. All right. Awesome. Is it now this? Is it this one? I think it's this one. She has the cords and controllers for this. She's just the one where I That's okay. This is all the stuff that goes with this. Perfect. Is that everything you took a picture of? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, like there was a pile of that. That's the M64. And then this all goes with this. And the guides are kind of in between all the games. Hey guys, so I basically just took everything out to my car. Uh, I try to just be brief and uh, uh, leave as soon as possible because uh, you cannot believe what I just got here. So um, pretty awesome. I, and I, I try to just talk to her a little bit regarding, you know, like I'm a collector. So all this stuff that she's been holding on, you know, keeping it nice uh, will be, you know, it'll go to a good home so she was happy about that and i also left my number uh, well she has my number i told her if she find more let me know all right guys so you guys saw some of the live footage um i actually tried to do the live footage uh when i was there i got a little glimpse of it before uh my phone uh memory uh dies out i only have 16 gig on my iphone so and i every time i make a video i have to upload right away otherwise i run out of memory so unfortunately I ran out of memory, but at least I, I kind of sneak in and show you guys real quick on, uh, you know, the, the, the boxes of, that she brought out. All right, so I'm gonna start up in this corner like always. Uh, keep in mind this lot is a total of $250 that I was spent. So $250, keep that in mind. Let me, let me know, comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Is that, is this lot worth $250 or? Uh, or uh, is it a bad, buy, a bad buy? So let me know. All right, so uh, right at the bat here, we have the two Zelda, rare Zelda games on the GameCube. So the two that she has here, the first one is the Legend of the Four Swords uh, Adventure. So this one's pretty awesome. Really nice condition, complete and everything. And I actually have the, the, the link cable too to cut that goes along with it too. So. Uh, I'm going to add it to this piece right here. So I have a, a actually like three or four of these copies already. I might have to post for trades or uh, sell it off to recruit uh, my $250 back here. But actually it comes with the manual in really nice condition. So right there. And then second we have uh, Wind Waker. 
and with the manual really nice condition complete as you can see and bonus uh, memory uh, card I didn't even notice that so that's pretty cool next we have secret of mana so I, I believe I do not have this game so finding this complete inbox nice condition a uh, few ding here and there but complete inbox along with the official game guides that's right there is a plus so right there um, you guys know how much this game worth so that's pretty awesome really nice to add the collection I actually played this when I was a uh, uh, little back then and this game is actually really good RPG alright next everybody know Earthbound all right so everybody know Earthbound you guys know how much this game worth you guys know this is one of the funnest game one of the best game on uh, Super Nintendo but for some reason you know out of my what three to five years looking and hunting for video games I never run into an Earthbound until you know this day in the wild so that's pretty awesome and actually, if you guys continue watching my video, I actually ran into another humongous lot. And it has Earthbound with the game uh, guide also. So right at the bat, um, from what I know, this one goes for around 180 to 100. And then this guide right here goes around 90 to 100. So keep in mind, the lot was 250. This right here is already close to 300 bucks right here. Just these, these two. So basically... The rest of the game is free. So I can look at it that way. So, uh, yes. Earthbound. Next, we have Zelda. A Link to the Past. Nice condition. Unfortunately, there's no box, but it has a manual, the secrets, and the map, and the game guy. Unfortunately, she didn't have the box. So, unfortunate, but that's okay. I cannot complain. All right. Next, Secret of Evermore Strategy Guys. So, like, past month, uh, I started to pick up one. Uh, I finally run into one and now I'm starting to run like two or three. So once again, got another one. Uh, this one complete in box. Most likely I will keep this and swap the other one out because this one is really nice condition. And it comes with the strategy guide. So that's pretty awesome. All right, next. Another game I've been searching for a while. Breath of Fire 2. So I actually played this game too back in the days and I love this game. Uh, finally got it. Uh, unfortunately, once again, it missing the, the box, but the lady did have the manual and the strategy, guys, and it's in really nice condition. Okay. Uh, all right. Now, here we go. Uh, some more complete in box. We have the first Breath of Fire complete in box. Awesome. Perfect dark. Um, good game, but, you know, not, not a very expensive game, a good game. Um, I have a few already, so this is probably going to be on my trading uh, stash. And then, one of the rare, uh, not rares, but it is one of the rares of all is uh, Lufia here. Uh, this is the first one. Awesome, awesome. I can't believe I ran into it. This is my first time running to this game in the wild uh, since, you know, I start hunting. So, this is pretty cool. And this one is actually in really pristine condition and it's complete so that's pretty awesome I'm so happy adding this to my collection I actually never play this too so I will be trying out this game next we have Star War complete in box 007 Go 9 complete in box and then that's it for the Super Nintendo uh, next we have some complete in box Nintendo first off we got Dragon Spirit don't know much about this game it looks kinda cool maybe I'll try it out and then we had uh, Mad Max. Never played this game before. Uh, looks kind of, I don't know. Looks like uh, something I, I don't think I would play. But you never know. I'll give it a try. If you guys played this game before, and, then you, and uh, let me know. Let me know what you guys think. But complete in box. Next we got Shooting Range. It looks like this is using the Zapper. The only game that I ever play using a Zapper is the Duck Hunt. So maybe when I have time, I'll try this out. It's another uh, zapper game uh, using the zapper gun, so that's pretty cool. Complete in box, and then we have uh, March Rider, complete in box, right there. Nice, nice, nice. All right, and then the last two uh, complete in box, the best of all that complete in box, not the best. Actually, there's another one right there, 
uh, right there. But these two, the Zeldas, uh, I believe, yeah, I believe this is my first time running into complete in box and then in nice condition with everything. So I'll be swapping out the one I have for this right here, complete in box, the two Zelda, um, the first and the second. So that is pretty cool. All right. Uh, here are just two GameCube games. And then we have some uh, Super Scope. We have a Super Game Boy, the manual for the Nintendo. And then we have Lagoon with the manual. And then, now I'm going to go on this uh, Nintendo here. Uh, first off, we have Crystalis, Final Fantasy, Ultima, and then uh, something that I've been looking for uh, in the wild for a while now. I actually seen this in my retro gaming store, but I just don't want to, I don't want to spend my money. So, but finally, I actually got the whole set. So, we have uh, Dragon Warriors. Really good condition, Dragon Warrior with the manual, the map, and everything. Uh, and then Dragon Warrior 2, this is the only Dragon Warrior that she has that was complete. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, comes with the map and also a strategy guide. So that's awesome. Next, we have Dragon Warrior 3. So I actually seen um, this right here selling at my retro store around $60 to $70. Just this game alone. So I think that's a little bit overpriced, but still, that is crazy. Uh, but yeah, cart, manual, uh, maps, and all those you know crazy guys. I don't know spells. So that's pretty awesome. Next, I also see this right here at my retro store selling for around 70, 90 bucks. Um, I didn't. I can't believe that this worth so much. But Dragon Warrior Four, uh, really nice condition with the manual. It's just really unfortunate that she has everything else but this she doesn't have the box for it so but I cannot complain it's $250 so you cannot complain about that uh, because you know like something like that right there pays pay more than back with a lot of all of these games. Alright so lastly uh, she did have this two console the Super Nintendo and Nintendo the only problem is it didn't came with uh, the cable and the controller uh, for the Nintendo, but this did came with everything plus the manual. Uh, the bag is kind of cool too, as you can see the Nintendo Power one. Um, so she said that once she find uh, the course, she'll give me a call back. Uh, and I left my number, as you guys know from now on, everywhere I go, every everybody I met or buy um, the, the games from, I leave my number and my email and stuff. So then, uh, and I also let them know I'm always buying, collecting, uh, all those things. So, um, so. This is where I actually got it from. It's just people, you know, finding me and just know that I'm buying. They, they pass on my numbers, and this is how I get all these stuff right here. So, the recommendation, guys, keep doing that. If you guys are not, do it because uh, in turns you guys are gonna get a lot back. So, um, she said she she said so. Get that get that back to me, and she has uh, a basement that's still full of stuff. She hasn't gone through. Uh, she might have more games, so I'm looking forward to that um, you know I'm looking forward to our call so I cannot wait but uh, guys that's pretty much it for this uh, epic epic pickup uh, let me know what you guys think comment below let me know what you guys think about my pickup is this uh, worth 250 bucks uh, is uh, you know some of the games here you guys play before highly recommend it for me to try out let me know and uh, I'll see you guys next time